In most communities, school and summer just don't mix. But Amityville, Long Island is a town with another story. Licks aren't any different from the ones in your town, but I'm almost sure the school is. It takes a pretty unusual classroom to draw so many enthusiastic youngsters on a hot summer day. The studies don't include any reading or writing, and the pupils themselves prescribe their own homework. The cooling waters of Long Island's Great South Bay serve a classroom. Bathing suits are the uniform of the day. Bruce Parker Ski School, that's what the sign says, and no wonder the kids are enthusiastic. It's no wonder that the teacher, Tom Jenny, never has any problems with tardiness or absenteeism. And Tom is an old hand at the water ski business. And of course, boat handling is an essential part of Professor Jenny's duties. There is much that Tom doesn't know about boats and motors. He and his Evinrude Big Twin are inseparable pals. This outboard powerhouse has get up and go to give a breezy ride to a full crew. And the gear shift makes close in maneuverability a cinch, just like driving the family buggy. It looks as if Tom is ready to give his students their introductory lesson. It's customary to give the class a quick look at the course before actual skiing lessons begin. There's nothing like the tang of salt spray to add zest to a hot summer afternoon. No wonder our water sport fraternity has such universal membership. Who wouldn't enjoy a rise, Greyhound of the Waterway? Ah, but let's not get to enjoying it too much, students. There's school to think about. The first ski lessons are fundamental ones, and the beach is our classroom. But it isn't long before the students put these rudiments into actual performance. Skis on, lines straightened out, the big twin takes hold, and our students skim the surface of the bay. Turns become graceful, swooping arcs as the skiers plane in perfect balance. Balance is important. One slip at this speed, and our students would be swimming, not skiing. Here's a trick maneuver not recommended for the beginning skier, a dry landing. Why, the girls didn't even get their suits wet. Oh, well, just like a woman. North American water ski champions, Evie Wolford and Bruce Parker demonstrate some of the trick riding that has carried them to many championships. This one takes plenty of practice. Trick riding requires steady, smooth pulling power. Emilio Zamudio, Mexican ski champion, does a 180 degree turn off the six foot jump, and it's form like this that has taken him to the North American Jumping Championships. This next stunt takes plenty of stamina on the part of both the skier and the motor. In fact, it calls for power plus. Evie and Winnie Wolford show what it is like to ski through marsh grass. If you're a novice, these tactics aren't advised for your first run. The water above the roots of the marsh grass is only about two inches deep. Taking a run of this kind is an obstacle course that puts plenty of drag on the motor and on the skier. Watch the way they wend their way in and out of the grass by applying pressure first on one, then on the other ski. 
Maneuverability comes only with practice. Ups a daisy. When you want to finish the ride, just drop two lines and skid to a perfect stop. It just doesn't seem possible that even a big Evinrude twin could pull three skiers from a dry grass start, but watch. Off they go, and in a few seconds they'll be swooping along as if pulled by a locomotive. Here's what happens when one gal forgets to bring along her skis. This is the kind of stunt that requires many hours of practice and countless spills, but when it's perfected, it's a spectacular exhibition. It looks as if Dave Harrison has been bitten by the marshland ski bug. He joins Evie and Winnie on a jaunt through the grasslands. Looks easy, doesn't it? Most anyone, young or old, can soon master these techniques with patience and practice. Whether you're six or 60, water skiing offers fun aplenty for all who don the water runners. It's one of our greatest sport thrills. local Evinrude dealer can give you more information on America's fastest growing sport. Drop in and say hello. Find out why Evinrude's big twin power is the choice of America's water ski champion.